up to the year 2000, Jamaican music was predominantly released on vinyl, on album and seven in single formats. The process involved recording on tape and then transferring an analog format to an aluminum-backed master acetate. The acetate was sprayed with silver nitrate and plated in a nickel bath. It was then put onto a press. The result was the vinyl record. At Harry J. Studio in Kingston, Jamaica on December 9th, 1982 at 1.55 a.m. Jamaican recording artist Lord Sassafras finished a recording session that featured the single International Jockey. Known as a horseman, Lord Sassafras was a top DJ from Black Scorpio Sound System, the teacher for General Trees, and a top 10 chart recording artist. In 1983, Sassafras left for New York City with his master recordings and pressed the vinyl onto 12-inch singles. Sassafras moved permanently to Toronto, Canada, leaving the Harry J. Recordings with his good friend Big John. These vinyl recordings remained at Big John's for 30 years. This is the story of the hunt for the music of Lord Sassafras. In a journey from Cleveland to Toronto to New York City, juggling across the border. Born in Jamaica, Christian in a J. I was a righteous and your mother J. Born in Jamaica, Christian in a J. I was a righteous and your mother J. Britain would do what Jamaica way. Britain would say Jamaica way. Pass me your go dancing at the Jamaica way. Down the road, sit down in the Jamaica way. Jamaica was an island full of wooden water. We had two airports in which to enter. Name them Norman Manley, then Alan Sangstar. Tourist, this is your chance. Come discover everything we do. Jamaica way. Everything we say. Jamaica way. Rock for your go rock him now, the Jamaica way. That's where you go dancing now, the Jamaica way. We are going to cook in the Jamaica way. Yeah. And it's using his own gamma GTF and I'm with a man called Lance and Fresh Chicken. I'm going to be like, you know. Great soul called the roots. I'm going to tell the things that I would say. Bob Black, I'm going to try. I've seen a while. Ah, yes, that is the great Lord Sassafras. I'd say that's one of his great horseman tunes, a tune called Four Legs Gallop. And that's on the Ashantites record label out of New York City. Hey, you're tuned in to WRUW's Night of the Living Dread. I am Rich Lowe, and I'll be here with you for the next two hours. And we're in our 34th year on the radio here in Cleveland, Ohio. And uh, I've got another great Sassafras tune lined up for you. Step up in life. Sassafras alongside Barrington Levy. Hey, I'm Rich Lowe, and welcome to WRUW Radio. Uh, years ago, I interviewed Lord Sassafras and wrote an article on him. And from that point on, uh, I had a friendship with him. He'd been talking about a box of music that he had in New York City, 50 copies of a tune called International Jockey on the Horseman record label. And I've seen these copies go for $100 a piece on eBay. And so for 20 years, we've been talking about this, and I've been encouraging Sassafras to go back to New York City to find his music. And uh, the plan is to leave tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. This is juggling across the border. Well, it's 5 a.m. here in Cleveland, Ohio, and I am on my way to Toronto to pick up Lord Sassafras. And so I'm going to pick up Sassafras in Toronto and head over to New York City and meet up with Big John. It's 5 a.m. departure time. We've arrived. Arrived. I got this Jennifer on camera. We have driven five and a half hours to see Lord Sassafras. We are going to New York City to collect his singles, a big stack of them. International jockey. So let's go see Lord Sassafras. <laughs> Good to see you, sir. Thanks, boss. Where is it? Glory! Is it, hallelujah. Is it my size? <laughs> size matters. Exercise. <laughs> Turn it around, no size matters. Yeah, take care. Exercise, you see that? That's how we do it. <laughs> Maximum, <laughs> large. Large and in charge. Colossal. Good to see you, man. So what you got? You got something in the kitchen, you say? You, you see that? Yes. Breakfast time. I'm representing. Hey, come time. with us. Mind the door now. Take off your shoes. 
Ano ba? Dugo ko lalo yun. Some greens. Nice, nice. With, with, um, with, um, Salfish. Nice, perfect. And, um, Oko. Perfect. And then, yeah, gummy, nice and gummy, gummy. Eh, I'm gonna make another thing here, you know. Uh-oh. Look at them problems. Oh, yeah. Now, is it you cooking or is it Miss Jennifer cooking? Me. Oh, okay. Nice. Jerk. I just come in this morning. I work last night. Is that jerk? Okay. Right? Yes, sir. It's a, it's a buffet style, so you can... Yeah. I'm going to start with the saltfish and the kalaloo. Huh? And I think I'll move straight to curry. Bread. With some cocoa. All right. And some bread on the side, too. What's go... on the agenda? So, well, it's, it's your agenda. We're going to okay. go to New York City, meet up with Big John. I, I am going to go to New York City. Yeah. I'll meet up with Big John. Correct. I'm going to yeah. join you, right? All right. That's, we've got a couple things. We've got to get across the border. And you say you're not sure if they'll let you cross I the border. Know, don't, don't let me. Why wouldn't they let you cross the border? I have a problem with them every day. Oh, do you? Have, you had to turn, have they turned you around before? Many mm. times. Oh. Okay. But I think it would be nice to them. So what's the, what's the secret in getting across? Yeah, probably they ask my name. And then we're going to go find Big John and get your music. Now, tell them what the music is. Well, we're going to look at um, one of our last gems, which is International Jockey. International I Jockey. I did that recording in 1982. When we were coming up in 82, at RJ. Disco, 45, those disco them days. So. We'll try to find it, but we can't find Big John. We know him <laughs> sick, but we have to find him. You know, not firm again like one time. So we're going back to your old stomping ground. And then what were the, like, two of the clubs that you, you played at? Well, the biggest one I built, I built more ball. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Galaxy. Galaxy. At Brooklyn. Let's be on our way. Let's do this like Buddhists. I don't drink. I don't smoke. I don't snort. But if you give me the mic, I surely gonna talk. Well, at 20, you know, we're gonna cross the border. So we're gonna cross the border. I'm on the fire. Say, girl, I love the way you walk. I love the way you talk. I love to see you smile. You're a cool up and But I wish you were mine. I wish you were mine. I wish you were mine, y'all. Wow! I ain't got no money, no baby. No silver, I no die. All I need from you, honey, is to love me all the time. I'm a survivor to one step, but instead to make nine. The checking of the bank, you know, my must sound the sign. The matter about me mean, but me know me kind. The lyrics of my black, the whole life, they may not be right. Me say, find your line, find your line. Find your line, the girl I walk on way. Find your line, find your line, find your line. <laughs> Bring by my son, what did we come down? What made us out to the one time? Yeah. On my way across the border, we're going to Kingston Way. Kingston Way. I said, we're going to cross the border. Yeah. Why want to watch that woman's turn to make nine? The chicken of the bank, you know, but most of the sign. The matter about my main but me know, send my kind. It's slim, it's slim, it's slim, it's slim, you know. You don't be wild, me say, show ca shine, show ca shine. Yeah, I'm a steak, girl, she does a wiggle and a wine. Me ca, show ca shine, show ca shine. The girl, she does a wiggle and a wine. I ain't got no money. Yeah. No silver or no da 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 da. All I need from you, baby, is to love all the time. I love the way you walk. I love the way you talk. I love to see you smile. You're a cool, 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 cool operator. You're mine. <laughs> You're mine. You know why? I've been trying a long, long time. Still, I kill me. Get that wrong with the say so. Every little thing I try to do seems to go wrong. Uh -uh. Yeah, yeah. It seems I've done something wrong. But they trying to keep me down. Oh, Jah bless me, say no man curse. Thank you, Jah. I'm not the worst. Must come one day. That I must come.
But I must come one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bring bombers down, only the wind come down. Oh, me, you know, man, I want this day, day. Live the life, love my love, life, but live you love the mind will give. I tell you one time. Dump them, sasa, young, they dump them. Dump them, rich, you miss them, dump them. Dump them, rich, you miss them, dump them. Rope them, rich, you miss them, dump them. Anyway, you go. I mean, say, anyway, you go. And you not hear what the old man say. No tie, no donkey, don't. So, me say, hear what the old man say. You know, people put your down there. This is a sound that when you love. And this is a sound that when you love. This is a sound that when you want. And this is a sound you want to get. Yeah. I'm gonna say, and your mom say, you make that get sent. You listen to that person, they get like one damn break. Put them pampas and soap and in check. Where them are worried and not friend, them are friend can't must come, yeah. Better must come. Must come one day, eh, eh. but I must come. Make a woman bump up on me 16 and any big gun. Him you cheap me for seven magnum. Yeah. Science. Now at the border. Yes, we are telling you. Think they'll let us across? My belief across. So we can't cross the border. But we are flashed on the air. <laughs> we'll see exactly what happens. <laughs> Passports in hand. Ready to go. American passport, Canadian passport. And there's probably easily 40 cameras on us right now. I'm going to sign off. So, so we made it, we were successful. But Sassafras, you were praying as we drove up to the gate. <laughs> wow. Why were you, so then, and you also told me that the last time they arrested you, they pulled the bumpers off the car? Yep. <laughs> and they called your mother? No, I took my mother once too, and they take me in with her, and I said, hey, she asked her, how long you want to stay? She said, two days. I said, you're crazy. You're going to stay a month. He said, get out. We're not talking. <laughs> so I don't have no time with these guys anymore. No, sir. And they asked us, have you been arrested? Either you've been arrested. And what did I say? No. And then when we got past the border, what did I say? <laughs> yes, I've been arrested. We've both been arrested. <laughs> We've both been arrested, so. But all for good stuff. I think mine was jaywalking, yours was jaywalking, right? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Very good. So there's your jaywalking update. We, and we passed, so we got Jaywalking and constantly on the mic talking. <laughs> <laughs> so the next uh, piece is to get into Brooklyn successfully and meet up with Big John. I tell you, dance dice. <laughs> In searching for my music, I just want to establish some dates. In 82, um, we recorded songs at Ari J. Um, I then got a visa and I went to New York in 83. So in 83, we released the songs. They were even released before I reached 83. And then about 91, 92, I left to Canada. And I never been back, you know, until now. So Sassafras, you know, the one thing that struck me is that this is the first time you've been back to New York City in 20 years. Yeah. Wow. How come it's been so long? Many bottom on them can't agree on all them stuff. I do, I do. Used to use my name. God, my name is so common. My God, Jones. Everybody has that name. Very common. And if I even go to the doctor, I gotta be careful. I went to the doctor once to do my right knee and they wanted to cut the left knee. Mm. Cause you have so much Michael Johnson. So that's mm -hmm. a Michael Johnson. Which one is the right one? Address that to be right. 
date of birth of you, right? So they wouldn't let you in? No problem. And then the problem, and then describe for me. They said they're coming to murder in 80, 80, 84. And I wasn't even here in 84, man. Yeah. I came here in 82. So what year did you kill the person? Huh? <laughs> what year did you kill the person? <laughs> I killed the person in 80. They said I killed the person in 82. Okay. 82. So, oh, that's yeah. interesting. So they, they actually questioned you about that at some yeah. point. No way. Oh, wow. Yeah. But let me let me ask you more specifically, like, the last time you came across the border, you had troubles. Like, the, you said they took off the fender, off the car, and were searching the car? Yeah, yeah. Search up the fender, everything. Huh. Pull over the engine. And then did they just return you, or did you get a... You got, did get arrested, right? Did they return... No, no, I'm going to get arrested. They, they detained you, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so then 20 years, long time. So when you came back, you said you were so excited, you didn't think you'd be able to sleep. No. Yeah. We were driving through the, 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 the parkway, and you were pointing out all the areas. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you knew we were in Brooklyn. I, was, I thought we were in Queens. And you said, no, we're in Brooklyn. We're in Brooklyn. We're in Brooklyn. Yeah. 20 a.m. Even the computer said we were in Queens, and you knew we were... We are in Brooklyn. Tell me, like, most artists in Jamaican music don't own copies of their own music. Yeah. What is the meaning of you finding International Jockey, one representation of many of your, your singles that you've released over the years? Mm -hmm. Well, this song means a lot to me, um, International Jockey, because uh, we did it because when we were going for the visa, we didn't want to miss we wanted to show them that we were a recording artist and we were going to run away. You know, so we did this as a backup. So when we go for the visa, we would be okay. So um, I own the songs. You know, um, John was my executive producer. So a lot of recording artists doesn't own the masters of their songs. But I own my master. So that's why this song means such a long, a lot for me. I had to go for it. What made you go into music and not, like your dad was a racehorse trainer. Why didn't you go into uh, the racehorse business? I'm always in the racehorse business. Because I'm a horseman. Always. Live and die a horseman. But growing up as a, 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 a kid, a child in the ghetto, um, we have birthday parties, right? So when we go to birthday parties, it was not about going for the food or the presents. We had a, a program. So we have a program that we put on. So, you know, everybody will go there and show the, showcase their talents. You know, you recite or you, you do a little skit. So I usually do Miss Lou. Here's an update. We are now in Brooklyn, and when we arrived at Big John's house, we were told that someone who had found out about our trip had stolen the box of singles just before we arrived. Now, Big John cannot speak, but as we searched, Big John motioned to Sassafras using a communication board with letters and numbers to explain something to Sassafras. Big John was describing a 50-gallon barrel pushed up against a cabinet, and behind it, he had hidden his full collection of Sassafras's recordings. Now here on the right side as we approach is Big John in his wheelchair, and this is just moments after Sassafras walked out of Big John's home with his entire collection of Lord Sassafras music. Yeah, we just come in a place uh, for a long time, and this is the place of the original. Here's the first Milan. We just come from Jamaica, Pine Street. You got some, and you got some music here, Big John? But um, yeah, we come from America, and I'm a stamp on them. Yeah. So we'll find some old stuff. See that? Stamper, original. Mm. And you got a big stack of them here, too. Yeah, man. What, what, what kind of record do you do? No, these are the stamper. Uh, the, these are the mother for the music. The press. The records. Oh. The records come from this. The guy. records they make from that there. Yeah, yeah. watch, right? That yeah. that's there. This one. Yeah. Oh, you was in the record business? Yeah. yeah. You didn't know you don't know a star. Producer. Who is it? Who is it? 
Sassafras. <laughs> Watch out. So we, you live here, you don't know what's going on? They don't know what's going on, no. <laughs> in my mind, they could put yeah, me, do do. they could put me in jail That's right now. I would never, I would never know. Well, finding Big John was a great, great link for me because Big John was a horse man, you know. He's a horse man, and um, he helped me out. He was the executive producer for the songs, so we had the songs at his house. So I was informed that the songs are there, so I should come and pick the songs up. Even in the morning, like two hours away, they say they have the songs. When I reached at the house, the songs disappeared. So then I was feeling so upset. I said, yo, man, look how far we come and we don't get nothing here. You know, it was so sad. Then John started to indicate to us, you know, and his board with his alphabets that Master, he said, he had, I said, the master, he said, you know, if you don't have a record, the masters are there. Look upstairs, behind the barrel, you can see. So we'll move the barrel and we'll go up there. Lo and behold, we saw tapes, we saw the master, and one day they get copy. You know what I'm called? One day they get copy of the whole albums. And it's supposed to be 50 of them. You understand? So um, we took them downstairs. Someone who wasn't on camera started shouting, no, you can't get them. These are the masters. You know, how are you going to take away the masters? I said, this belongs to me. The master and the tape all belongs to me. Ja Life is a historic record shop owner and producer of Jamaican music in Brooklyn, New York. And in this next scene, Sassafras meets up with Ja Life in his shop. And then we have the opportunity for Ja Life to play international jockey and have Sassafras toast on the rhythm. Check it out. Yeah, and I'm No, no, I'm Yeah, man. Ja Life. Yeah man, and Sassafras, mm -hmm. and the Lord of the King of Glory. Yo, yo, me get the thing enough. You know? Just find it, you know. Let's, International let's Jackie. Let's see it. International Jackie. And what are the lyrics on that? What's, what's it about? Great Jamaican Jackies, man. Okay. I love to see the race horses. And we're going to have no, Jalife play it. Jalife, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Junior. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know if you need help, man. Back cool. We'll have the yeah, expert, the expert. Run it. Back of all, too. Let's play this. That's an idea, right? International Jackie. No, put that side that. See that? No, that that glasses, you no, need to, man. And no. you will give me that side, yeah. Like, yeah, but you will give me yeah, that side. Yeah, but you need your glasses, do you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but put that your thing, like. Look at your that thing, son. I'm from 1982. I want everybody anything, like. 1982. I mean, you're probably anything. Roll no horse is horse, it's lost, it's lost. But no DJ can tell about the horse. You have a boss called Long Sam Sopras. I am a drumming fan, Jackie like riding in a England. When we reach a England, them say I champion. Some say that we ride like John Trotter. When it comes to winning race, we win it on the flat. We better than the Jackie name, let's stop the God. For some Jackie, we them by the dozen. Right. 
Say the back of all style. Now here comes the life original. I'm gonna first it. First to make that nice system. Everything I'm Juggling, juggling, juggling on the 401. 
heading to Kingston, not London. Going towards the border. I in America area. Me no say we happy cross the border. Happy cross the border. Juggling on the poor old one. I went to reach it and I the hands man to me. They no say don't stop the call. Right now you come and we call it. And if I dance a few ram, we will go ram it up, 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 Oh, that's an old flyer. We're live. I'm taping. So what you got? I found this store some about Nettie Vince Turgoff. What's coming for the first time? The first time in uh, New York. You see, Rivet Asman. What year do you think that is? July 29, 1983. Oh, very good. 1983. Mm, that's nice. Suitable for framing. So what did you get? We were on the trip, and now we're back yeah, well, we'll in Toronto. Long lost, some long lost tapes. We'll find the stamp of the um, International Jackie. We hunted for years. International Jackie. We hunted for years. We wanted to find these. So we'll find the stamp of here. And this is the record that we were looking for. It's called International Jockey. And that's what we put, that's what the uh, Jalife played last night. Yeah, Jalife played the first last night. So. Okay. With it on the right track now. We put and so you not only found your music. You clash to them telling you about. We make the most money in this one. You see this a young press? Ah. You see Charlie? Aha! You see that Osman label? And that's by 83 too? Yeah, it started in 2983. Look at that guy. Ah! My boy, Charlie. Those were the days. Yeah. Yes, I I made a with security. You know I made it. <laughs> wow. Uh oh. Thirteen seventy or three seventy six. Yeah. Oh, these ones are some tape. Some tapes with some rhythm. So that's like the master tape then. Yeah. This is this this is four tracks. King of his back nineties. We're not just starting. Um, we got cuts from different producers when we do stuff for them. Everybody have this film, Shanghai Shake. In Jamaica. Barry Bowa, open the gates. Barry Bowa, Africa, we want to go. Baba Boom Rhythm. If you want to do something now. And Shanghai Shake. Wow. So those are like special mixes that you would have to DJ on. Yeah. Yeah. But these are four tracks, so we gotta try out. And not just special mixes, but like a dub treatment to them, so it's unique. Yeah. Yeah. These are the mixes. And though. then that is the master. Mm. And it's listed here as 1982, December yeah. 9th. And there's the, some of those tunes are listed Electric Boogie, What a, a Mini, yeah. uh, Big Bad, and then International Jockey. That's there. That yeah. is the one that we searched for. And that's the one that we played at Jelly's place last night. 1.55 a.m. So the uh, trip was successful, Sassafras. You got the music, you got the flyers, you got the stampers, and you have the masters. Yeah? We'll get brought up. A little extra. Mm -hmm. Everything good. Everything good now. Everything is good. Everything is good. Original team. Yeah, techniques. Very delicate, you know. That uh, serious. Yeah, man, from 1982.
Ma buona neve. Ma vuoi avere il fatismo? No horses, horses, classes, class. But no DJ can tell about the horse. You have a boss called Lance and Sabras. <laughs> I am a Jamaican Jackie riding in a England. When we reach a England, then say I champion. <laughs> and good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Caminus Park here in St. Catherine. They're lining up now for the A1 handicap at a distance of one and a quarter mile. They're all in the gate. The starter looks over the field, and they're off. And Ramesses breaks cleanly. Legal light alongside. Now moving up the challenge early is Element. They race past the stands. It's Rika fourth. Royal Dead is fifth. Cup of tea sixth. Kandahar seventh. Coming away last. Bonnie Blue Flag. They race around the clubhouse turn. Ramesses with the lead. Legal light staying right there with him. Element is poised to challenge third. Rika is a close in fourth. Now Royal Dad moves out, Cup of Tea moves out, Kandahar is there with Bonnie Blue Flag into the back stretch. They race on to the Caminus Park far turn, and it's none such for the lead. Gallant challenging on the outside. Mary Poppins still lurking third, second fiddle is there with Majestic Steve. That has Mercury, Sarnia Kanita, Jackson Ska, and the distant trailer lord Sassafras. Into the stretch they come here at St. Catherine, Jamaica, and bringing them down, none such. Gallant is right there now, stride for stride. Mary Poppins seeks room to the inside. Second fiddle is right there as well. That is Majestic Steve moving out. Mercury is now with a late rush on the outside. Sarnia Conita is there with Jackson Scott. And still way back there, Lord Sassafras at the wire. It's going to be tight. None such and go on. Our heads apart.